Yo, yo, it's Trap Sam the God, USB Cartel Media, and we back again with another one, y'all. Hey, it's hot as hell outside today, man. The other day they said it was the hottest day in world history. I guess today is another hottest day in world history. But back to the news, man. Uh, it seems like Lil Boosie, you know, he got a problem with anything dealing with police snitching, talking, telling, whatever. You know what I'm saying? And then the, and the topic of the uh, conversation today is Kodak Black, Boosie, and Wack 100. So if y'all ain't know, y'all was under a rock. Oh, yeah, my boy 6 9 man, the rap. But if y'all ain't know, 6 9 and Kodak Black just dropped a new song. He paid Kodak Black $1 million to hop on that bitch. You feel me? I don't know too many people passing that shit up, you know. Then Kodak Black dissed him on his own track. You know what I'm saying? Got paid to diss a nigga. So I don't know how I feel about that, but shit, congratulations to him. Just got an M to drop a verse. You feel me? But it seemed like uh, Boosie upset with that shit, man. He said, Call that black ain't never been gangster. He's a goofy. Uh, he's a rapper. A, a capping ass rapper. Fucking it up for the streets. Uh, Kodak Black, you know, he responded. Basically, talking shit as usual. You know, they're going back and forth. But it seemed like Wack 100, like, man, nip that shit in the bud, Boosie. He told Boosie, like, basically, you know, you ought to uh, calm that shit down. Him and Kodak Black are good friends. And uh, him and Boosie are good friends. And they want to stay good friends. He need to fall back. So we know what that means. It's pyro business. So I wonder what the fuck uh, Boosie got to say to Wack. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, I guess Wack stamped and approved what Kodak Black is doing out here, man. He's, he, I guess he's not snitching in the eyes of Wack 100. It's a business move. See, that's what y'all understand there. It's a business move. All the time with Wack 100, he don't give a fuck what you is. Vice Lord, GD, BD, Crip, Blood, whatever. But it's always pyro business with him. But for some reason, it seems like the money, the money come first, man. As long as it ain't too much disrespect, you know? And I know uh, everybody got opinions. Opinions are like assholes. Everybody got one. And nine times out of ten, what? That motherfucker stink. If y'all want to hear my opinion, my opinion, man, shit. Every man need to mind their own business, man. When nobody know your business, couldn't nobody snitch on them if they, if they didn't know your business. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, what another motherfucker eat don't make you shit. So, I really don't care about it. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck if he did this on with him or not. I, I don't plan on telling neither one of them niggas my business. You feel me? But that's just me. Uh, I don't condone any uh, ratting and snitching shit. If you uh, did a crime and you get caught, do the time. Don't bring nobody else in that bitch with you. You feel me? Be a smooth criminal. Michael Jackson. But, shit, you know, who am I, man? It's just uh, rumors and unpopular opinions and shit. I want to hear y'all, man. I need y'all to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Let me know what the fuck y'all think. Like I said, I need y'all to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, man. I need the algorithm to go up. I need more subs. And I'm going to give y'all more content, man. I've been dropping a lot of content. I'm dropping a whole bunch of more. Man, it's Trap Rich saying the guy, USB Cartel Media. And we out. Yeah, man, your business, man. Everybody need to mind their motherfucking business.